our latest how to vlog so the rolling burnout vlog i asked you guys what should we do for our 100k special and beside that you were arguing about how should i speak in my vlogs or german or english or spanish or indian or i don't know how we found a really interesting comment dominic you can blend in the comment right yeah of course okay so blend in and thanks on a db killer eins probably from germany hey we get uh, for the cool comment and yes i should bring back some memories so this 100k special for our youtube channel gonna be all about the scooter dominic you had also a scooter right yeah the loudest one which one was that it was gilet runner with a static exhaust but it was a 50 cc right yeah but sounded like 70 cc more like Ooh. formula one formula one <laughs> i hear you when you were going that was an epic fail for the fifth bomb. I hear you when you were going from the school back home like 10 kilometers away I was hearing Domini. So for all the scooter haters you can either stop to watch the vlog or join us on today's 100k special with a lot of burnout school tricks with the scooters. I'm gonna show you some tuning what we did with the scooters so an epic vlog is coming. A quick live stream gopro hero session 5 giveaway from our live stream yeah let's make somebody happy okay let's choose i'm gonna just scroll randomly and you scream stop okay cross 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 my mouse stopped at basilis epsimaris from greece so this hero 5 is going to greece enjoy it enjoy it send us some cool pictures with the gopro rob Stop chatting with Mariana, we are vlogging man. <laughs> no, no, I'm just sending the message to Basilis. We need his address so I can send him the GoPro camera. And message sent. Since we are already sitting behind the computer, Dominic, my, you know how my YouTube career started, right? <laughs> yeah. It came from fooling around with a scooter and just practicing some basic tricks and so on. And film everything with my brother's camera, I think. There was no 4K back in the day, right? Only HD, no full HD, but HD was the, was the best what you could have. And if the camera had a film option, that was a cool camera to have. So that was the brother's camera. We took it and we filmed everything what I did with the scooter, mm -hmm. right? And and yeah, it was this is only just a small pocket camera. And this is how my social media career started. And so we became famous, right? Yeah. <laughs> Your social media career and my photograph career. Career, exactly. <laughs> and 10 years later, we are here. We have a lot of bikes. We, we travel around the world and we film how we fool around with the bikes. We still do the same thing, yeah, but, but we are paid this time for that, right? Yeah, bigger bikes, bigger cameras. Exactly. Let's do an epic pre-mix for my scooters for the epic tricks. Done. So what's the ratio of the pre-mix? It's 2%. Uh, That's always what we use on the scooters and 1% on my trial bike. So let's fuel the scooter up. Why are you cleaning the scooter so much? Man, since my bad memories from the start, when I was starting with the scooters, I was the only guy that was always, but really always wrenching on the scooter because it always broke down just moments before everything started. It was, or it was a show or a competition. So everybody made fun of me, which I understand, but this happens when you don't have any paper in your pocket for the spare part. So I'm, since then I'm really, taking care of the bikes and I'm stressing my mechanics because I want everything perfect to avoid these problems now when I have all the parts for my bike so I want to have my stuff perfect Let's put in the last screws and go to the action part, right? Let's finish up and let's do some two-stroke burnouts Bam 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 Why do you have five bars this time? We need to have a lot of pressure this time. I want to have a big bang on the final burnout. Before I show you my epic tuning on the scooters, 
let's enjoy some scooter port from Headlands. always a tuning nerd and I love tuning the scooters I wasn't the best but I learned from my mistakes after a few years and luckily on my last two years of my scooter career I got a really awesome sponsor state six uh, they didn't pay me to mention them but anyway they were such a good supporters and they gave me the best parts what they had and they helped me to build these two legendary scooters so I'm gonna walk you through the setup what we did on the tuning and Dominic which bike uh, sorry which scooter should should we start this one or this one? The right one. Let's start with a freestyle scooter. I'm taking down the cover so I can show you how we tune my scooters. Okay, let's start on the most interesting part of the scooter. That's the engine. You don't see it there, the cylinder. And the inside, the transmission side. I think it's transmission, I don't know. Uh, anyway, so the line of State 6, the racing line was called RT. So they gave me all the RT stuff they have. So I have a RT Variomatic, the RT belt, the RT bell, the clutch uh, and the torque boost. That system really improved my performance and especially the cooling of the clutch. This was always the problem when I was riding the scooter, the clutch was always overheating. Another RT part was the suspension and that was a really cool update on my scooter. And then we added and welded on the frame the freestyle pegs on the frame and on the block. So I can also do tricks here on the, on the wheel. Maybe I should add this on my uh, KTM bikes. From the freestyle pegs we go to the wheelie bar. This was my first part that I did and developed. And this was the start of Rockbugger parts, actually. Dominic, come here. We got here, check this. RB stunt parts, come closer. And this was the beginning of Rockbugger's stunt part. Wheelie bar was my first product. We still have it on our online shop. If somebody wants to tune their Yamaha Aerox bikes, they can get it. So uh, yeah, we are now, what, seven years of our, our Rockbugger parts. We, we stopped that idea for the last five years and we started two years ago. So we are back in the game. So, okay, the next thing is Magura gave me a really wide handlebar, which was really cool to have a lot of control on the scooter. So that was a nice thing. I cut away the original handlebar and welded new mounts and I put the handlebar on. Brakes are stock. Uh, another cool thing was the front disc, oversized disc. So a lot of bite and a really good improvement when I was doing uh, stoppies. Yeah, I forget, we started already with parts. That's actually the base of the scooter is Yamaha Aerox. We tune it from 50 to 70 cc with a sport uh, cylinder and we transform it from water cooled to air cooled so it's cooling better when I'm doing tricks. That's basically it for the setup. That bike was more for the freestyle tricks. And the next one that we go now, it was meant for the high speed wheelies and burnouts. So it's a kind of a drift burnout scooter. So let's go check it out. Okay, so from the freestyle scooter with 7 horsepower to my burnout high speed wheelie scooter with a mid race cylinder 70cc around 15 horsepower and it has also a sport exhaust from Rust and also a 21 Delorto carburetor so the engine gets more fuel. So that's actually the difference and it has also a racing uh, ignition for more RPM. So that scooter was really a lot of fun. Now when I'm riding the big KTM bikes it doesn't feel so fast as it was but still brings a big smile on my face so okay that's about the tuning and parts and so on so it's time to celebrate a hundred thousand subscribers and let's do some crazy tricks I'm a bit rusty on the tricks let's warm up first <laughs>
Damn it, I forget what kind of tricks I can do with the scooter. Ah, oh, yeah, this one. Okay. Ah, <laughs> yeah. Now over to Rock, who's just 20. The young Slovenian has been on the circuit for two years. Oh yeah, this one, yeah! You could do a special K jump. Back in the day I could do it, so let's see if I can still do it. Come on, we can do it. Tricks with a scooter aren't so easy. There is no clutch, I forget how hard it was to ride a scooter. That's kind of a special K jump. It's not perfect, I know. Uh, okay, the next trick, what was really interesting was uh, I scraped the wheelie bar 90 degrees and then I just rolled back and then continue to do a wheelie. So let's Good. try this one. Go. Come on, I don't want to speed this up. You have to do <laughs> it quicker. I know it's a slow one, but man, I'm quite rusty, I see. Okay, check this one we have. Oh, the bike is easy, but the throttle and the automatic system is not easy. There is no clutch, man. Arm pump is coming. I forget you can get an arm pump on the scooter also. Okay, next trick. Let's do some stoppies. Why it's so tricky to do the stoppies? Because the tires are freaking seven years old. They're harder, so let's see if I can roll some long stop. What happened? I ran out of fuel, man. That was probably the reason why I was always broke in my scooter times. Damn scooters are thirsty, man. my racing scooter in a good use let's celebrate 100k subscribers thank you for the support let's burn out Since we are already on a teenager scooter, let's do some teenager fire burnouts. Dominic, you, I need your help a bit. I'm scared of the fire. You take the fuel, I take the scooter and we do a fire burnout. Okay, let's go. Wait, I'm just gonna put the camera here on. Okay. Focus. Okay, it stands. Okay, let's go. Okay, this is your... My tool. He said we're gonna pop it, so... The tire has so much grip, we are so close to popping it. We gonna do it man, we can do it, babe. thousand subscribers that's it man man i shit myself <laughs> <laughs> yeah man dominic high five damn tires still burning that's the hundred thousand special guys 
thanks for subscribing thanks a lot freaking 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 a lot for support and yeah dominic what's the next milestone what should we hit the next 500,000. 500,000. okay guys you, you hear dominic 500,000. let's freaking rock and roll 2018 and let's burn a lot of tires this year so guys see you next week until then rock on